Okay, so um, I just wanted to show you everybody a really easy way how to jailbreak your iPod Touch. Now, m you might have tried this before. I uh, think, oh, it's a screw that my iPod booted into DFU mode. Well, they um, there's a new version out, and it's made for the iPod Touch. So you just go to your Google and enter in Xiphone, and go to Xiphone's blog, first one, and download that. Um, if you're running a Mac, which is better, press here, if Windows, press there. It's kind of simple, and it will download. Take me. Okay, so now that that's downloaded, I'm going to open that up. It's going to launch. Yeah, if you're running Mac, it'll give you this. Just click open. Um, bouncing on the dock. Oh, here it is. Get rid of this. Okay, so. When, once you're here, um, what uh, what you do is you're gonna plug in your iPod Touch. So I'm gonna just doing that now. Okay, so you plug in your iPod. There's a funny thing; it's launching iTunes. Okay. All right, so it's just computer's kind of slow. Alright, so this is in my second display if you're wondering. So go over here, Jack Mitchell's iPod. And then I will click restore. But since 1.1.4 is the current version, as you can see here, I can I don't even have to do the option click or shift click. So I'll just click restore. Press restore again. Go to extracting software. And it will do its thing. So I'm just going to turn off the camera as it's doing this. Okay, so now you'll say this, your iPod is restored. To fact your settings, you're always restarting. Please leave your iPod connected. It will appear in iTunes after it restarts. Click OK. So I'll just let it do that. Right now I'm seeing the Apple logo on my iPod. Looks like a normal startup, and it's showing me the, um, the, the dock connector and an arrow pointing to iTunes. So I assume it's connecting now. It's giving me the beach ball. Okay, now I've got slide to unlock and sync in, sync in progress. And it gave me the um, it gave me um, an error on oh, a message on the iPod. It says edit home screen. You can do all that dragging that. Okay, and just set it up as a normal iPod, a new one. And here it is, zero songs, it's brand new. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna quit out of iTunes. Okay, and um, I'm gonna go over to Xiphone and press jailbreak iTouch. Not jailbreak, jailbreak iTouch. This is for the iPhone especially. Um, on some iPod touches this does work, but you know, how, how stupid could you be to press it? Uh, refurbish, that of course, just, it's a restore. And if you have an iPhone and you want to unlock it and all that, press do it all. So I'm going to press jailbreak iPod and start process. It says loading, searching for iPod, entering recovery mode. And it is giving me the Apple logo working. Oh, okay. It says connect to iTunes. And iTunes just opened. Please wait 45. Okay, now it's put into DFU mode. It's giving me a bunch of code with a black background and white text. It says it's checking all these files. It's just going really fast. It says it's updating this, checking catalog. Looks okay, and now it's rebooting again, which means it is good. iTunes to get your iPod. Just ignore that. And once it is rebooted, um, it'll mount to iTunes. And you've just gotten yourself a brand new, well not brand new, but you've got yourself a jailbroken iPod Touch. I got slide to unlock with the battery charging for thing. There it is, 1.1.4, you can see right here. If I slide to unlock, I have the installer application with another, it says Zebra's blog. Don't know how to pronounce her name, but she did a marvelous job with this software. So it's over here, his iPhone completed successfully. And uh, and um, yeah, that's it. Um, it worked great. I'm very proud of myself, even though I didn't make this. But um, yeah, 
I hope this works for you. And if you get an error on your iPod Touch that says uh, BSD Stack Overflow or something like that, then just hold down the Home button and the Power button and keep on holding them until it shows you the Connect iTunes picture. And then you can just restore it and you're back and I guess you'll have to find another method. That happened to me, but it seems to be working fine now. Thanks for watching. And, uh, yeah. As you can see, the, the iPod is completely jailbroken. Um, it is 1.1.4. If I hold down something, they all start to wiggle. I can drag them around. I can get rid of this. Stupid thing she put on there. And it's gone. There's my... If I go to settings, and then general, about, oops, about, I can go down and you can clearly see, even though it is backwards, you can see that it says 1.1.4. Thanks for watching my video and I hope all goes well for me, all, go, all goes well for you. Um, if you have any questions, just post them in the comments. Thanks a lot.